Hi, welcome to this video where we will explore how to add music or audio to your Power BI reports. Adding audio files to a Power BI object isn't something that is required a lot. But still, we have worked with clients that have asked for this, so we decide to show you how it can be done with the HTML with Creator Custom Visual for Power BI. Now, we will show you how to add music or audio to your reports in just a few easy steps. First, let's create our HTML viewer. And now we need to create our measure here. So let's get some zoom here and name it music video and open the codes now let's start by creating a very simple title and let's give it a style as example i will give it a orange color the title will be music and audio in Power BI. Let's close the heading title here. Now we are in the important thing is the audio tag. The audio tag is simply you need just to open it like this. You don't need to use the close tag of audio like this or like the header. Okay. So, but there is some attribute you need to use in the audio. So let's start with the important attribute is the source. So here you need to create the source and I have already a simple link for my audio here and after this you can create the type here and the type you will type audio and after this you need to to donate the extension what the audio use in our example we have the mp3 ex uh, extension okay let's put it here now we have our audio but we need the important attribute so let's get see first the result and after that i will give you the important attribute now the shown example and the result will be just the heading here okay so Let's go to see the result. Let's give here our measure, and here is the result as I said. It's just the title. Why? Because we need the important attribute, and it's controls attribute. The controls specify that the audio controls should be displayed. And now we will see our audio here okay so now I will give you other attribute but the important is controls so the first attribute is autoplay the autoplay attribute specifies that the audio will start playing as soon as it is ready. So when I click OK, the audio starts automatically. Let's see the results. And as you can see, the audio starts automatically 
The second attribute is loop attribute. It specifies that the audio will stretch over again every time it is finished. And the last attribute is muted attribute. The muted attribute is specifies that the audio output should be muted. Let's see the results. We can play here the audio. And we didn't hear anything because it's muted. So, once again, we have shown that anything is possible with the HTML with Creator Custom Visuals. Did you know that it's also possible to add videos or animated GEFs to your Power BI report? Find the link to the video showing how this is done in the description below. We hope that this video has been helpful in showing you how to add music and audio to your Power BI and that you are now equipped with knowledge to take your reports to the next level. Thank you for watching this video.